go. Now what? Now fucking what? Who do you think's got this? Scrabble just won it last time, but Catherine Look. just had five grand games of uh, I see pubs. a Catherine. You think so? I see a Catherine here. So do I. It's Absolutely. Who is hungrier? And not hungrier metaphorically speaking. Like, who wants to get food? Because it is... Uh, Did you see that clip where someone's getting coached by fiction? Have you, have you seen that clip? Uh, there's a lot of fiction coaching. So, there's like a clip where fiction is doing a lesson with someone. And he's like watching it. And it's like, you know, like a couple socks in. Like a, two, a couple games in. And he's like, are you eating correctly like are you hungry when you play this set and he's like oh. I mean funny you mentioned that because I was really hungry and he's like yeah that's a big problem <laughs> <laughs> really yeah yeah it's so good wow. it's so fucking good like you just want to get out of there and have something to eat. well he was just like subconsciously he was just like sure. there is an event there's like small advantages to not eating or like at least like uh, not being fully like playing on a full stomach kind of thing. yeah I haven't eaten today and I played like shit so. yeah well so his thought process is that it's not just about like you know like like there is a mental benefit for like, um, there is a mental benefit for like you know, not eat uh, not eating that much or like not eating at all. Um, however, the thing about it though is that in his mind he was like, yeah. So you want to remove the kind of like the factor of like uh, playing on something. Oh, Bradley going off right now. Holy shit! But he was just like, yeah, because like when you're in this situation again, you don't want to be hungry again. Right, so yeah. so you, you should eat. It's so good. No, if you spot someone being hungry, uh, basically what happens is they want the set to be over as soon as possible. Yeah, so you can go eat. Yeah, exactly. And so they'll play like that, and like it's just a net negative because it's like uh, in, fi in fiction's mind, he was like, you know, uh, yeah, you need to be able to go to the toilet. That is true. Is, is that better or worse? Needing to pee? Needing to pee or needing to eat? Uh, Which is worse? Needing to piss so bad. Needing to piss fucking blows when you're playing melee, especially if it's like game yeah, four. Yeah, okay, like, I agree. Oh shit, I need to piss. I agree. It's like, do I. I like Jack's. I like. I like Jack's theory here. I had that, uh. Best. I was playing like a best of three. Oh, well, there you go. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. I don't like how Stratos has had like a couple socks to get pooped. Yeah, I mean, he's uh, having some controller issues earlier, but he said well, it's he was crispy. Did you hear like what Josh does for like mages, or like what he did for mages in America on his like game mode? His uh, no, no, no. What like his like his fucking preparation. What was? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. He just like doesn't eat, doesn't sleep, or anything. So it's like complete shit. Yeah, I'm like, that's fucked, man. Like, yeah. and, and he's like, yeah, all I can think about is gaming. And it's like... That's okay. I kind of do that oh, sometimes. Okay, sure. Um, I just need to sleep that, well. that sounds to me like you might... You might have some... Uh, uh, you might have some... Uh, dopamine receptor issues. Yeah. <laughs> you know. All you can think about is gaming. I mean, to be fair, you can't... Uh, you can't miss the... Uh, I guess not notice the process. I mean, he is fucking gaming right now. Yeah, oh well, yeah. Dude almost got into the top eight playing Pichu, so... Yeah, I had to put a stop to that. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. I had to put he, a like, stop to that. Beat, uh, beat a bunch of people. He beat everyone. Yeah. And then I'm like, I'm Falco, man. 3,000. <laughs> <laughs> Falco Master 3,000. Wasn't that Super Boom Fan? Yeah. I know that can take Scream 1. After an unfortunate SD. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, so... Yeah, so like Fiction was saying, he's like... You know, after you win grand finals, your kind of body shouldn't be like, oh, thank God that's over. That's what he said. When you win, after you win grand finals, you should be, you should feel so fucking psyched. Like, think about it, right? You just won, you just won a tournament. If yeah. you win a tournament, think about what this, like, the connection that gets built in your brain. If you win a tournament and you're on an empty stomach, what does that say to, like, the habit formation? Thank God I get to go eat. Well, yeah, like, thank God, like, I don't have to play melee anymore. Yeah, or I played all the possible melee, did my best, and now I get to eat. 
I don't know. Fiction's, uh... Yeah, but because, like, at a major, for example, right? You have to play, like, five, like, maybe, like, two to five, like, grand final of a local tier players in a row. Yeah. So if you play one of those people at a major, and, like, you've built up this, like, habit in your mind, or, like, this connection in your mind that's like, oh, thank God I don't have to play any more melee, right? When you beat one person at a major, you're just going to be like, I'm not fucking ready to play the next match. Yeah. Right? So you have you actually have to be satiated, because by the time you win grand finals, you should be like, hell yeah, can't wait to play more melee. Like, you want to do thug finals? That's what, that's kind of what, like, Viction was getting at. And yeah. I think that's pretty, like, I think that's actually pretty good advice. Yeah, I always, pretty much always want to play more. Mm. Win or lose. Mm. I uh, I just hate that a lot of the tournaments just run so well. Before, like, my fucking housemates were having a party till like 4 in the morning last night. So I just made it. It was fucking insane. Did <laughs> like, you have fun though? Or were you just in your room? No, I was, I was like, hey guys, can you, can you yeah. shut the fuck up? <laughs> yeah. trying to sleep. Like, I got, got, I got, two, me- I got yeah. two melee tournaments. I've got, bro. there's this game that came out in 2001 on the GameCube. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's <laughs> actually a really big deal. This is... Oh, I need you guys to stop having fun. So I, I mean, this is a bigger deal than that. Yeah. Oh, and shit. I'm surprised that didn't work. Oh. 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 Bradley, Bradley combo. Oh, he's missing. That sucks. Damn. Uh-oh. Fucking down smash. See, this is close, though. I'm still like... Oh. Oh. Getting hit at like 75. And then just dying. is rough. Oh, the tick throw. And that doesn't fucking send him the right way just yet. Ooh. Catherine, not cleaning it up, but yeah. that might do it. Nice. Uh, just covered everything. Yeah. That was so nice. Like, I was worried that those aerials weren't working, but then she covered it. It was so good. Hey, that's nice. Nice. Ooh. That was kind of a nice smash moment, to yeah. be honest. Dude, now? It's dude, fucking cold. One dude, I was like kind of surprised by that. How we had the oh, oh, oh shit, oh, there we, we go. Mm. I was kind of so shocked. We, for anybody that can't really see behind us, we have had two huge doors open, blasting in cold air all night, straight into the melee setups. So, kind of shocked anybody's been able to play over two inputs per minute. Brad's my dad. We love Scrindles. What's up with top players not reporting their stuff on Smash GG? Um, uh, I'm not sure. I have seen that a few times. Maybe ask Kai, who's actually good at the game. What's up with uh, top players not reporting their stuff on Smash GG towards the end of the tournament? Somebody in chat has asked. I won't do that. Because we're all no, just in general. They're all fucking gaming. This was 3 2. This was 3 2, by the way, wasn't it? Uh, Captain Puff. Yeah. Yeah, this was 3 2. Last game, Battlefield. Great game, too. Jesus. We'll be here for a little bit, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> We've actually got Imagine if Catherine resets. Right. Could she fucking imagine? Imagine if Brad resets. It'd be huge news for, for Dice fans. <laughs> what is Dice? It's a crew. Really? It's a crew. Never, people. never put that together. I can tell you what, where it comes from. Me, Jasper, and Ruben, we were walking to the after party at like, oh, damn, go Bradley. Um, we were walking to the after party at like, bam, eight, bam, seven, eight or nine. I yeah. Um. And I think Jasmine just had these dice on him. And like, so he would just throw them like on the street. And like, it would be like a dare based system. So you'd be like, uh, like you'd say something like, you know, kind of like, oh, bet you won't get, or like, bet you won't do something, right? Oh, yeah, like odds on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, bet you won't do something. And it's like, all right, pick a number, right? And if your number comes up, you lose and you have to, you have do, to the do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's dice game. But with dice. That is dice game. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we played that, uh, but you would just you'd go depending. <gasps> oh, oh my god, she's so swag. Depending on what it was, it would be if it was a small thing, you go all right, one to twenty, and then three, two, one, and you both say oh, the number yeah. at the same time. I see. Yeah. Yep. 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 
This is <laughs> anyone's game now, but there's oh. the CC, Dink Smash. So oh, Catherine's just... Oh, she's just protecting herself with attacks. Jesus, you literally don't approach him and you just uh -oh. laser. Oh! oh! And Brad has she's stolen gone. It. He has stolen it. Oh, sneaky. That was good. I love that. That was really sneaky. <laughs> Brad. Cat should have won. Looks past the camera. Cat should have fucking won. But here we are in this timeline. Ready? Go! Alright. Back to it though, but straight back to FOD. This Jeez. is the Catherine's Oh, wow. Oh my Huge. god. Huge. This is a Still massive going. start. Turn up pool. Tries Catherine. Rare footage of Catherine. Wanting to. Oh no. Oh, no. Another one. No. Misses the shine. Okay. Alright, Bradley trying for it twice. Does not pay out for him this time. Highway honesty. <laughs> not highway robbery. Highway honesty. Or like, no, we call that highway philanthropy. <laughs> it's the opposite of robbery. <laughs> I'm using highway philanthropy for something. I have to. You just like Santa Claus and you just throw him shit at the window. Yeah. Yeah, the beach is out here. Yeah. It's throwing turnips to everyone. Giving, giving you produce for nothing. She owns the means of production. Man, she does. We have had this conversation before. Peach is, uh, she does own the means of production. She says, like, a yeah, yeah. What if she lost, like, a single hair for every turnip she pulled? But she doesn't. It doesn't go back. Oh, no. Oh, no. Damn. Oh. Rinsed. <laughs> Is that, a, is that a cold or a hot wash? In the... That was a cold wash. Uh, do you know why we had the doors open the entire time we were playing? Uh, well, probably because of... Like, we have to have it open during the day anyway because there's lots of people in here and we need airflow. Yeah. You know, COVID is airborne. True. Um, yeah. But, like, so cold. right now it's fucking cold, so I just closed them mostly. Yeah. Still a bit of airflow, but she'll be right. Mostly close. I, uh, I think you just. Sean Rock coming on the top to find us. Yeah. Oh, and that is. I think you just cashed this one in. And well done. Firefox into the last one. Alright, well done to Kath, bringing it to 2 2. Going into game 5. Alright. Better than being hungry, though, right? <laughs> Ready? Go! Jim's mowing with the finest Victor Mar. Yeah. Really do be like that Ian's page. Nice. I think she's past CC percent. Or Brad's just calling out what she's gonna do. Yeah, like the grab. <laughs> Full focus. I am, am happy. I'm simultaneously happy and really fucking bummed out that uh, we have such even match melee. It is, it is currently 8:50 p.m. Whoa. Up smash. Oh no. Oh, shy guys fucked it. On a match like, on a stage like Yoshi's, like, Fox is gonna have to actually work really hard to try and make this back because there's nowhere to run around. Also. Just kind of has to chase something out. It's really good damage. She keeps uh, getting Catherine when she's floating, so she can't just sit down and smash it. Fucking hell. Yeah. Uh oh. These platforms are so small. It's like, where does Fox actually have to run? Oh! Oh! Clean. We gonna get a last stock situation game five? Spoil. 
Yeah, copyright stealing Kai's spot. His word's not mine. Is it Roisino? It's Roisino. Oh, oh, here we go. Alright. I mean, Scry Daddy has done this before. It sure has. I like the way he plays. He holds forward. Yeah, he, uh. He's a real. It is lost stock. Game five. I'd yell at like, I'd yell at I'm sorry. I'd yell at Kath, but uh, she is in a lost box scenario, so I don't think your advice is quite well fine. Yeah. Shut up, Kai. Ooh. I said stock of champions, and he's not upset. This no. Oh, way shut up, it. Jack. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. Oh, it's too low. No. Oh, you gotta take that. Ah, GG. The dream is dead. Catherine takes it. The dreams. Well played. <laughs> Kath playing a third set in a row.